Hey, welcome back to the shop. I got this piece, I believe it's maple. And I'm not necessarily looking to turn anything specific other than a test to see if this type of wood has figure. What happens is uh, me and a friend of mine, Jim Williams, go to this place to get wood and uh, what they're like, full logs. So we took a piece of this and uh, it was cut in half. He turned the other half as a live edge and it didn't have much because if it does, it would be more here than there. So I'm turning this the other way just to see if if it's worth taking the rest of the tree for like making stuff. But anyways, let's just try to make something out of this and see what comes out of it. See if it's got a figure basically. Okay, we're around. Now let's try to establish a top edge so we know where to stop when coming the other way. Okay, that did it. Well, we're gonna have to go slow here. Slow as in feed, no speed. There might be some flying bark. If you notice, if you watch my videos and you notice my lathe is quiet today, it's because I changed from the small pulley to the bigger one. Don't you love this blind cut? Uh, you have to pick a line and go for it. Well, this might have something, but I don't think we can go too far with it. It's going to be tough to do a nice curve with, considering that there's always going to be uh, voids all the way up to the edge. But it'll be a neat challenge. Hopefully, I don't get to eat a piece of bark. Just start here and pretend there is wood there and just go. We're going to need some kind of a tenant that holds this. All right. Let's see if we can do a good pass. vibrating a bit.
And what I hang out, we call that a good pass. I think I'm gonna leave it right there. My question is, can I do a tenon on that? Hmm. Not sure. It's gonna be enough meat to grab it. Hmm. Let's see if that works. We will want the cup to be chances of this thing together are slim. This is something that Kim is playing with coloring. I guess this would be a good candidate for epoxy. I'm not a fan of epoxy, for that matter I have a whole couple threads going on on Facebook asking people questions because I want to do a video on the pros and cons of using epoxy. One main one being the fact that this is renewable environmentally friendly wood and the second you put epoxy <coughs> we turn it into wasteland so I do not like using epoxy for that reason but for what I'm hearing people will buy something with epoxy ten times before they'll buy something without it so that's what that's at at this moment we got some refine this edge a bit it's not even turning a hundred percent true but that's turning at a thousand rpm believe it or not So it's here, there, there, and here. Let's try it, we're gonna have a loose. Think there. I'm not sure about there, but I'll put some anyways. And here for sure. up properly count to 3d yeah one why don't you just make it even more dangerous well I'm gonna let that dry for a bit and I'll come back and uh, make a fly again so I switch cameras for a bit because uh I'm gonna, I don't normally wear a face shield, but I'm crazy, but I'm not stupid, so I'm gonna wear one for a bit here.
did not survive. Check this out. This camera will focus. It did not break at the glue line. Well, even though that broke, the conclusion is this does have some nice figure. So I think we should bring some more and try this again. Because, you know, we got to learn. And if you don't take any risks, there are no rewards. So anyways, that concludes this one. I'll thank you for being here and uh, we'll catch up on the next one. Ciao, ciao. Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. Don't go away. Um, so after some uh, messages, uh, I'm going to give this to a friend of mine, Frank Drinkwater, and uh, he's going to use epoxy and rebuild this. So if you're a regular viewer of, the, of this channel, there'll be an update on this. I'm also working on this guy. It's going to get color in the outside of it. And uh, yeah, that's uh, my girlfriend Kim is playing with this. And um, as you can see, I'm making a mess. But anyways, ciao, ciao again. See you soon.